Somali is the national language of Somalia, and authorities here want the language protected and promoted. To achieve this, it has ordered the business community to replace billboards and signboards written in foreign languages. Our plan is not to fight foreign languages. We encourage people to learn these languages. As the local administration, all we want is to promote the Somali language. We want all business adverts and billboards to be in Somali language. This move has been welcomed by majority of the population. Adhan Afe is an artist and cartoonist and delivers his message in Somali language. He is among the supporters of this new government initiative. This is a very good move the local administration has initiated. I'm a well-known resident of Mogadishu and I'm proud when I see billboards and businesses using Somali names. English is a language you should all learn but not at the expense of losing our native language. Awes is a commercial tricycle rider in Mogadishu. He has been having difficulties in reading billboards and signs that are mostly in Arabic and English. I am a driver. I have basic education. I'm in support of this new initiative because it's very hard for me to be able to read or write other than in Somali. We should all promote our language. That is the only identity we have. But these business owners feel that the timing is not perfect. Among the issues it has raised is security and cleanliness. It wants the local government to prioritize issues and encourage business ventures regardless of the language they choose to use. In January, the Somali Arts and Culture Academy officially opened its doors in Mogadishu after more than two decades and coincided with the 43rd anniversary of the Somali language. Majority of the business ventures that will be affected by this new government directive are located on this road, known as Maka al Mukarrama. But interestingly, the Somali education system is offered in both languages, English and Arabic. And Arabic is the official language here in Somalia. So it's unclear how this issue will play out. Abdul Aziz Bilal, CCTV, Mogadishu, Somalia.